Gaming Fin Nation Zan Juan Pimmer, also known as Black Bob. I'm here with the man, the legend, the soon to be icon, right? In music. Word. J. Cole. <laughs> he felt good too, right? Oh What's up, man? How you doing? I'm good. So you put your song out uh for us about splitting cell blacklist, um, the Miss America song, right? Uh, so what it's like, tell us all about. Ah, it's dope. So I, that's a song that I had. Um but you know, I guess they were interested in, in using it for the trailer of the game. And if you look at the trailer, it fits. You know what I mean? I saw the trailer. It really does fit the, the feel of the game. Um, the song Miss America. Because uh, it's like aggressive, but it got a lot of emotion in it. You know what I mean? It just, it just fits. You know what I mean? You watch the trailer, you can see, and then you play the game, you, you can see the, the mirror. So when they reached out, it just made sense. Now, you say you played Splinter Cell in the past, like when you were, um, you know, still in college? Yeah, when I was in school. It was the reason why I got a. Um, an Xbox in the first place. It took me mad long to get an Xbox. Like, oh, everybody had one and I didn't have it, but then my homeboy put me on this game. He was just telling me how ill it was and I played it. And then I was like, all right, let me get it. Cause it was the versus mode, I'm a competitor. So, you know, anytime you put me on a, on a like a uh, head to head, you know, I'm, I'm interested. So that's what that's why I got a sophomore year. My girl bought it for me, my sophomore year of college. And I know she was mad that she got it. Cause I was on that joint like non-stop. You know, if I wasn't in class, I was playing that game. You know, so that was my last like real gamer moment. Other than that, it's just been sports games, you know. So, you, I mean, you definitely have that competitive spirit. So, I mean, now that Blacklist come out, you can get back into the versus yeah, yeah. online shoot. I mean, you still play online like versus mode? No, nah, I will on this one. Um, you know, but it's been a long time since I've actually been played like a real gamer's game. You know, and this is, you know, this is something I could definitely get into. So I appreciate that, 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 that gesture, that real game is game. That makes me oh, feel yeah, good. Oh, yeah, because no, I know the difference. Like, even all these interviews I'm doing, they're like, hey, man, so you a gamer? I'm like, nah, chill. Like, I respect. You know, it's like when they ask, are you like a sneakerhead? Or are you like, you know, no, nah, I, I buy Jordans, but I'm not like a, I would never claim to be in it. Like, like people that are passionate about it, like, are you passionate about games? I could never take the title of a gamer because, you know, I remember my older days though, like I would really buy the game magazines like and like flip through them and like try to find the codes or like read what game was coming out. But them days is, you know, them days is gone for me. I ain't got the time, but I still got the spirit in there somewhere that wants to like that same kid that used to uh, run home from school. It was this game called Shimu. On, on on Dreamcast, yo. Stop playing, my man knows about shit. You know, props. I got we got <laughs> we gotta stop right there because I know a couple of people are like, oh snappy like shim you oh yeah, that was my game. I used to run up like you know, it was very few games that could do this to me. That and Metal Gear Solid like games that I would run home because I couldn't wait to get home to play this game. So that spirit is in me somewhere, but I just ain't got the time and like the attention span. I can't even follow the shows that I want to follow. So let alone play the games I want to play. I mean, what well, I mean, you know, my belief is once a game, always a game. I mean, right. you know, it, you know, life is going to take you where you got to do. Even when I do what I do. Uh -huh. So, but once a game, always a game. Hey, I, game yeah, hey. I mean, I saw your skills in the game. We, we was playing, we was playing the bridge level. My man, he, he, we was we was doing it. We was doing it. Yeah, was doing, you know, I was climbing. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna come out. Climb that bridge. We gonna come out with the J Cole rock climbing game. <laughs> yeah, you ever wanted to be in the game? Oh yeah, for sure. That's like the dream. That's always been the dream. So we're going to get the J. Cole skin, right? Uh, yeah, take note. That's what we need. Yeah, we're going to get the J. Cole skin in the game. Yeah. You know what I mean? I got your back, Jack. Thank you, bro. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. For real. So, you know, as far as um, music, I mean, what, what inspires you to, uh, you know, create the songs you create, the music you create? Uh, I don't know. I'm just always searching for that rush, for that feel. You know, so I just go until I get that feeling. Until I feel like it. The moment where it's like, oh man, like something's connecting. You know what I mean? I'm like always searching for that moment of excitement. Um, so that's that's what it, it is. Of course, life too. Like the words are inspired by life. You know, and like things I see or like things that I want to say and talk about. Of course, um, I want to like have an effect on people when they hear the song, when they hear the, the music. I want to make them feel a certain way. Like, oh man, when you hear like certain songs on the album, Runaway. Or like, you know, rich niggas, or you hear Let Nas Down, I want you to feel. Like, when you hear Let Nas Down, you can be like, damn. Yeah. Like, you feel like you was me, yeah. you know, hearing that song. 
or crooked smile once you feel like, yeah. You know, it's like certain emotions I want to put in people. Um, so yeah, so that's what I'm, a combination of all those things. It's not just one thing. I mean, could you imagine when you were back in your sophomore year, you was playing the game, and you, you could you ever imagine that, yo, my song will be in this game, that's like crazy, down the line? Man. I love when people say stuff like that, because I, kn- I don't think about stuff like that until until somebody says, like, could you, would you have, did you ever think, listening to Kanye, like I was at Kanye's show, SOBs, when I was 18, and then like to put out the album the same day as him, and like, I had the audacity to do that, it's like, wow. And then you saying that, nah, playing this game, I never would have thought like, yo, you know, what, what year was that? Okay, yo, seven years from now, they're gonna put out another version of this game, and your song's gonna be on the trailer. Like, if you'd have told me that, it would have bugged me out. I could have believed it, at the time, but like it's just still would have it would have bugged me out. Any projects you coming up or working on? Nah, Born Center in stores right now. First and foremost, Crooked Smiles, the current single, Power Trip, Kill the Game, Crooked Smile about to kill the game, uh, Forbidden Fruit, probably up next, and then she knows, and then wherever this album takes us, it takes us. Um, album is gold, headed to platinum, and then you know, other than that, I'm just producer for a lot of people, trying at least. Um, Elvana, Treasure Davis, these these singers, these female singers that are incredible. Um, I want to get in with Alicia Keys. I want to get in with anybody that'll have me as a producer, so I can just flex and show the world. Awesome. Yeah. Now, as far as uh, you know, my last question. Now we got the November coming up. The big, big, you know, top consoles coming up. Any consoles you looking at? Um, I want them all. <laughs> I don't want to be behind. I told somebody earlier, like, yo, I don't want to be that. I like, I'm older now, you know. I, I want to know. I want what the kids got. There's no way these new systems about to come out, and I'm not gonna have them, and at least know what's happening. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to be that dude looking at the TV, like, yo, that looks so real. <laughs> like, yeah, that's the point, man. That's what we're trying to do. So, like, I, I want to, I want to try whatever systems coming out, a new Xbox, new PlayStation. Like, I want them all for free <laughs> I like that because I earned it <laughs> I put in the work man I feel that man yo but like I said once a gamer always a gamer man I appreciate it Game of Fit Nations and one premier black bottle right here J. Cole peace